Serie A champions Eintracht dies. Liverpool is closer to the long-awaited EPL Cup. Real got his three points not without a scandal. And 15-year-old Messi shocked the world with his appearance in the match against Real. Hello everyone! Do you see how hot the world football is? So why didn't you still subscribe, hmm? Guys, correct your mistake! Friends, you have to confess in the comments what footballer do you have a photo with? While you're writing, let's get started! Liverpool will become the champion if Man City will lose points in the match against Chelsea. Martial set up a personal scoring record, kicking 18th goal in the season for Manchester United. Arthur admits the possibility of moving to Juventus. They are ready to raise his salary twice. Arsenal announced about the contract extension with David Luiz. A 33-year-old Brazilian signed a one-year contract with the Gunners. Thiago won't sign a new contract with Byron. He wants to Liverpool. Sergio Ramos set a new personal record, scoring eighth goal in La Liga season. Messi achieved the biggest amount of points for his club in the current La Liga season. An Argentinian brought Barcelona 15 points. Sergio Aguero had a successful surgery in Barcelona. Man City's forward had a meniscus injury. France national team and PSG's forward Kylian Mbappé will be the new FIFA cover star. According to the French media, Mbappé will be on the cover of FIFA 21. Among David Luiz, contracts with Arsenal were extended with Pablo Marie, Cedric Soares and Dani Ceballos, said Mikel Arteta. Manchester United became the first club in EPL history that substituted five players at the same time. This unusual incident happened in the 80th minute of the match against Sheffield United. Bin Laden's portrait appeared at Leeds Stadium. Club removed it and apologized. Real Madrid's midfielder Takifusa Kubo had an interest from PSG, as informs. Atletico's midfielder Marcos Llorente is recovering with the help of a bat that he bought for 35,000 euros. This bat not only recovers muscles, but slows down the process of getting old. What a technical wonder! Hull City's ex-footballer Thomas Beatty confessed in his homosexuality. The street near Ajax Stadium was renamed in honor of Johan Cruyff. A win against Levante was 194th for Diego Simeone as an Atletico manager. An Argentinian has equal results with another club's record holder, Luis Aragonés. Frank Lampard announced that Chelsea didn't make Bayer any offers about midfielder Kai Havertz, although the coach's face looks like something is coming. Guys, a little more fun! Malaysian media embarrass themselves calling Trent Alexander-Arnold Black Lives Matter in post-match report. Press like if you love this news! And now, to the main news! Yesterday, a couple of EPL, La Liga and Serie A matches took place. All the results you see on your screens. So, will we soon congratulate Ronaldo with winning a championship? Inter lost two points in a home match against Sassuolo. An astonishing shootout ended with a total score of 3-3. How else could it end for Narazzurri when Gagliardini can't score this? The main Juventus' rival for Scudetto, Lazio, lost to Atalanta having an advantage of two goals on 11th minute of the match. The hosts got the victory thanks to Gossens, Malinowski and Palomino, 3-2. Juventus' lead from Lazio is 4 points now. Yesterday, 5 EPL matches took place. We can notice the games where Manchester United and Liverpool participated. The Red Devils destroyed Sheffield United, right in the battle for the Champions League zone. The total score is 3-0, a decent game and hat-trick from Martial. Liverpool didn't feel any resistance from Crystal Palace. The total score is 4-0. Trent, Salah, Fabinho and Mane scored. After the match, Salah beautifully answered the question, will he watch a Chelsea Manchester City's game? Salah responded, no, I will be playing with my daughter. It's interesting if the City will not win. Salah won't play with the daughter and probably will attend Klopp's party honoring the championship. Right, Mohamed? 
Real beat Mallorca confidently with a total score of 2-0. Vinicius and Sergio Ramos scored and brought Madrid back to the first place in the table. The first goal had some doubts. Before Vinicius scored, Dani Carvajal probably fouled. Referees rewatched the episode with the help of VAR and decided that no fall in that episode was made. But enough of scandals, we have to notice a debut of the youngest player in La Liga's history. An Argentinian midfielder, Luca Romero, who played for Mallorca, who entered the field for 12 minutes at the age of 15 years to 19 days. The guy is called the new Messi and he debuted on the great Argentina's birthday. Coincidence? We don't think so. The guy looked worthily when he played, wasn't afraid and tried to sharp the game. In one episode he was viciously attacked by Mariano. Do Real Madrid players already feel danger from the new Messi? We wish Luca a huge success and a top career. Guys, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. It was Football News. Bye-bye.